What's up everyone? Welcome back to another Vinegar Syndrome video. This is going to be my Black Friday haul for 2021. This will be my last uh, halfway subscription package. Um, I didn't get the full year. It's a little too expensive. It's like $1,000 so a little too much at once. I wish they had two opportunities to get the halfway subscription because 500 is a lot more doable than a thousand dollars at once so whatever i'll probably get the halfway subscription again in may or june whenever they do that i have the halfway sale but for now this is the last subscriber package uh, i got a bunch of partner label stuff and a few of the new it's mostly new stuff i barely got any uh, discounted stuff so uh, i'll just get right into it i got a few dvds first First one being insert. Uh, it's one of the driving collections double features. We have In Search of Bigfoot and Cry Wilderness. I believe one of them's a documentary about finding Bigfoot, and the other one's just a campy Bigfoot movie. <clears throat> Next one is an adult title. This is The Ribald Tales of Canterbury. This has bonus feature of Tasty. This one is, is an adult title as well. This is Miss Magnificent. That's it for the DVDs. Now we'll do some partner label Blu-rays. First up from Saturn's Core is Sorority Slaughter. I had this one pre-ordered for a while. I'm not that much into shot on video, so I don't know how much I'll like that. I probably should have canceled that one. <laughs> Uh, then this next one is from Fun City Editions. This is Radio On. It looks like a, an old cassette. And there you go. Pretty cool little slip there. This one's from Altered Innocence. This is So Long Billy. Another one from Altered Innocence. This is Sound and Fury. I guess I'll show what's under there. It's the same thing. <laughs> Next up from Agfa and Something Weird, we have Smut Without Smut, Satanic Horror Night. Got that. Another one from Agfa. This is Bloodorama Triple Frightmare. Let's see, what do we have on here? We have Help Me, I'm Possessed, Night of the Strangler, and Carnival of Blood, all from the 70s. And this one is from. Decanalog. It's one of their new partner labels. This is Keep an Eye Out. Back's just blank. Another new partner label, uh, Yellow Veil Pictures. We have Knocking. There's that. And what I thought was weird is they have their company name on the side there, Yellow Veil Pictures, instead of the the movie title on that side. I just thought that was weird. And then there's the back. Last up for the partner label stuff. This one is from Subculture. This is a 4K of Deadlock. Back. And back to Vinegar Syndrome Blu-rays. We have China and Silk. And then a Wacko. Wish I had gotten the slip cover when I had the opportunity, but that's all right. Another one, we have Unmasked Part 25. This looks like a Friday the 13th parody, almost. This one was just the slip cover, but because I had the movie already. But graduation day. I love these legacy slip covers. There's the cover if you've never seen that. And 
then this is one of the new ones. We have Dario Argento's Trauma. Next up we have Creature. There's that cool, cool artwork there. And we have Steel and Lace. I don't know too much about any of these. Um, Vinegar Syndrome is usually blind bias for me. But they all look interesting. So Next up is one of the new 4K releases. That is Ebola Syndrome. I know a lot of people were happy about this one, so definitely interested to check it out. Next up, we got the two newest VSA releases. This is VSA number 19, TC2000, with uh, Billy Blanks there. I have number 828 of 5000. And then we have Tiger Claws Trilogy. This is BSA number 18. This is number 967 of 5,000. And then, then we have the films of Rudy Ray Moore, the box. Uh, I didn't have any of the movies, so I got the movies as well in there. I'll just show those real quick. These are all the reverse artworks. We have Dolomite, Disco Godfather, sorry for the glare, the Human Tornado, and P.D. Wheatstraw. I haven't seen any of these, but I heard they're pretty good, so looking forward to checking them out. Then we have one of their new VSP releases, like Vinegar Syndrome Pictures. Uh, I just watched this last night, it's really good. That is Sensor. And the slipcover has movies from the movie. So, got a Sunder and Beastman there. And then this is the normal cover art right there. Then we have the other VSP title, which is New York Ninja. I believe this is a lost movie from the 80s that they finished and put out this year. This is in a, like a VSU style box. You got the magnetic thing there. Open it up. You got the slip cover, of course. My Heart, New York Ninja, A Tale of Two Ninjas, got a little booklet, and here's the slip cover, and then there's the actual artwork, this is some Kung Fu Bob art, I was glad to see that, and then lastly, for my Vinegar Syndrome Black Friday haul, we have Flesh for Frankenstein. This is awesome. We got two cases in here. We have the regular Flesh for Frankenstein with a slip. And then you have Frankenstein 3D with a slip. And then you got... Oh yeah, this is 4K by the way. I'll uh, do that. Some boobies. And then under here you just have the same thing. But comes with 3D glasses for your Anaglyph 3D. It's got the logo on there. It's also regular uh, Blu-ray 3D, I believe. 
but if you don't have a 3D TV like me, you can use these. I can watch 3D Blu-rays on my PlayStation VR though, but I don't think I want to put a VR headset on for an hour and a half, two hours. But I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> Maybe I'll try it out one day. But yeah, that's everything I got from the Vinegar Syndrome Black Friday sale. Um, if you've seen any of these, let me know your thoughts. Like I said, most of these are blind buys for me. And uh, if you bought anything from the sale, let me know. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye.